Hey, how's it going, guys? Here's a tutorial on how to do a visual effects breakdown. So, um, to explain what a visual effects breakdown is to those who don't know, it's basically a video transition of showing how the animation or the visual effects are done by showing different layers of the um of the of the scene with a wireframe, with the model, with that material, and with materials, with lighting, shadows, and composition, and etc. Um, for some example, IELM Visual Effects Studios did some pretty cool stuff. Um, a couple of years ago, they uploaded the Avengers making video, which shows some pretty cool um, visual breakdown, um, visual effects breakdown scenes of the ship, the help transformation, and stuff like that. And um, they did another cool one, which was uh, Transformers: Age of Extinction, which had some pretty cool um, advanced visual effects breakdown scenes um, are from the movie. And recently, Rocket Jump Film School did um, a video called "Why CGI Sucks," except it doesn't. Um, and they and that video showed some pretty cool breakdown um, scenes and some good inf it had some good information as well. So, uh, without further ado, let's get to our tutorial. So, for this tutorial, we're going to be needing these four um, video files. Um, I'll put a link in the description box so you can download them for your for your scene. And the outcome of it will look something like this. That is basically what a visual effects breakdown looks like. Now that's a very simple version. So first is the, the original scene, green screen, alpha, then without no composition, then with the composition. So it's just basically a video, simple video transition. So to make that scene, we're gonna need all these um, these four files. So I've rendered out each of them separately, so it's easy for you guys. So first we got the green screen one, um, then the alpha one, then the one without the composition, color grading, and the proper lighting, and we got the original one with the proper lighting and everything else. Um, all these four files are at the same time, and all the helicopters are aligned with each other, so like it's easier to transition them. Um, that, that, that'll make more sense when we get to um, Premiere Pro. So, uh, you're going to go ahead and open up Premiere Pro. Um, now, by the way, this is a bit of an intermediate tutorial, so if you have any trouble following along, just post it on the comment section with the time, and I'll, I'll try to describe it as best as I can. So, um, you're going to go to File, New, and go Sequence. And just press OK. It doesn't matter which one it's on. Just go, just press OK. Just make a new sequence. Then what you're doing is you want to import your file. So you want to double click right here, or go, or go con Command Import, or it's Control I um, on on Windows. And you want to import these four scenes to your file manager. Oh, one other thing, you guys, like your layout on Premiere Pro might look a di bit different, like your file manager might be down there, but it, it, it it's the same deal, I just arranged it this way, so it's, I because pref I prefer to do it this way. Um, yeah, so you want to drag clip number four down to your timeline, like that, then scale it down so you can see a bit more of it. Now, you can arrange it any way you want, but I prefer to have it the original scene, then green screen, then alpha, then the one without material, then the original scene again, like I showed you in the um, the render I made. But you can do it any any order you want. Um, it's just the same deal. So, um, to get into the um, video transition, what you want to do is go quarter of the way, since there are four videos, we're going to go quarter of the way, and cut it right there. So, C, and cut the video right there. Then what you want to do is you want to drag and drop your green screen video and drop it from the start. Now you don't want to drop it right there because the helicopters are obviously not going to be aligned with each other when you do that. They need to be aligned. Since it's the same time, they'll be, al they'll be aligned quite well when you put it at the top. And you want to cut the video, the green screen video, the same place where we cut um, the original video. And you want to delete this section right here. Then what you want to do is you want to go to effects, then go to video transition, wipe, and look up wipe. What you want to do is drag and drop the wipe on the green screen clip, number one, like that. 
So if you play it from here, it's going to look something like this. It's going to give you a first wipe of the green screen. This tiny uh, little uh, bar right here, that's where it ends. So you can drag in, like, can, like keep your length, uh, increase the length of um, the transition if you want. But this is fine for now. So I'm going to go a little bit forward like that. Then cut the scene right here. Then I'm going to drag and put my alpha scene from the very start and cut it at the same place then delete it like that then you want to do the same thing go to effects drag and drop the wipe thing sorry the wipe um, effects on your alpha so it's gonna look like this now if you play from the start it's gonna look something like that and it's just um, just just du duplicating that effect is what gonna, what's gonna give you the simple visual effects breakdown so you want to go a bit further cut that scene Go to your file manager, import number three, which is your render without the material and the lighting, etc. Cut it from the exact same place you cut the alpha. Delete, delete this bit because you don't need it. And drag and drop your wipe effect. And it's going to look like this. Like that. And in the very end, what you want to do is you want to drag and drop your original file. Like that. Cut it there and delete that bit right there go to your effects tab pull your wipe scene and put it there and if you play it from the start it's going to give you something like this and that's basically it you guys now you're ready to uh, import your scene so you could just go uh, command M or control M on Windows and just export your scene the way you want it with the settings and that's that is how you do a simple visual effects breakdown. Um, you can lead to advanced things like you see on um, in movies and stuff with a bit more practice, but this will give you a general idea of how those advanced um, visual effects breakdowns are done. And uh, that's it. Sorry if the video was a bit intermediate. If there's any questions, like again, just leave them in the comment section, then I'll reply back within 48 hours. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.